My name is James Young, uh, born in County Tyrone, Omar and Northern Ireland and uh, I've been an MD for three years. Uh, Church of England, um, uh, before becoming MD I wasn't uh, a follower of any particular religion. Um, that was on my sort of birth certificate, although I, I've always realised there's been something missing in my life, so spirituality is extremely important. Uh, I became MD um, purely by accident actually. My sister was marrying a Muslim over in the Maldives and I initially started uh, reading about uh, Islam um, to find out exactly what she was going through in order to convert. Uh, I became interested and realised that, that I thought there was something missing out of my life uh, I thought it was a spiritual element. Um, I stumbled across uh, my housemates who um, had Muslim friends while studying and they passed on some literature to myself that were specifically based around uh, India and, uh, and past its history. Um, my friends and family uh, reacted uh, very positively. Uh, they started uh, initially um, because my sister already converted anyway, so she um, she'd already done a lot of the hard work. Um, however, so will any questions that happen to be asked from from fa family or friends, uh, questions that like I could answer, it seemed to it seemed to make it a lot easier for them. And they could understand where I was coming from. They could see how happy I was becoming. Uh, obviously, with my new sort of family in laws, my sort of ever growing family, they've. They get on extremely well with them, and I think that makes it all uh, all part of the sort of process, really. Um, there are a couple of things, um, three main things, I think. Um, the first point was the fact that I, I had no particular faith, as I've mentioned before, um, and that I always knew there was something missing out of my life, sort of spiritual element, um, which I know now. Uh, the second point I think was from reading the literature, I think it was the, the point from the sort of scientific point of view that it was the, uh, there was things that science couldn't explain and the books that I was reading, the literature I was reading from previous um, previous Hazurs, previous uh, anybody with a scientific background, the Quran could s seem to explain what scientists couldn't explain. So it's that element that kind of I really enjoyed and, and kind of brought me forward to where at the point where I was going to convert. And the third element I think was the was the reaction people were giving me, the the, the friends and and the family that I've created along the way, and so events like these where uh, where people are open open to. So sort of saying, you know, slowly film and, and saying what you're all about, really. Uh, I think the main point there really is, is as well as the family and friends and sort of ever growing, um, being a recent convert and having an arranged marriage, it's a slightly so outside from an outsider's point of view, from a Western point of view, it's a little bit unusual. But I, I, I wouldn't, uh, you know, I don't regret it. I don't, I don't ever look back. I always, always look forward. I think it's a very positive thing that's come out of my life. Um, and this sort of spiritual element, I think, is 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 why I convert, and I think it's it's why I'm so. Sort of, so spiritually ever growing, I think. Um, having the, the family and friends around me um, is, is having that sort of being being complete. Um, so sort of five years ago, not having that kind of spiritual element, and then sort of, you know, five years down the line, realizing that I'm more of a complete person, more of a whole person.